Well, grace and peace, everyone. This is Empress Bolton, pastor of One Way International Ministries. You have just tuned in to the Empress Bolton Show, and I am excited. I am excited because this is the day that the Lord has made, and I will rejoice and be glad in it. I would love for you to join us on Sunday mornings at 11 a.m. for Praise and Power Worship Experience. On Tuesdays at six at 7 p.m. is Get Plugged In, Spiritual Enrichment, where it's more than a Bible study. And I'm sure that your life will never, ever, ever be the same. I would love for you to join us. I'm telling you, the Lord has been moving. The Lord has been speaking in that place. You want to meet us tonight at 7 p.m. 200 North 40th Avenue right here in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. You don't want to miss tonight. It's going to be awesome and amazing. Well, I just want to jump right in and share a word today. I had been, um, just this word had just been coming back to me and coming back to me and, 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 and I shared it with a few people and I just wanted to come and share it with our listeners and, and with our Facebook live family. But the Lord had spoke to me, uh, and a few weeks ago, a few months ago, and he said, the season in which you have prayed for is upon you. The season in which you have prayed for is up on you. It's here now. And, and I, I, I kept plundering and I kept praying and wondering, okay, Lord, what, what are you saying? What are you saying? And, and you know, it's just like we've already, when we decree things and we, when we speak things, um, it, it does not disappear. When we speak the word of the Lord, it does not disappear. The word of the Lord, uh, when it goes forth, it goes into the atmosphere. It goes into the spirit realm. Now, I was looking in 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 First uh, Samuel chapter seventeen. Let me let me just go there. First Samuel chapter seventeen. First Samuel seventeen and forty six. And we all know the story about David and Goliath. But the Bible says in verse forty six. It says, this is David. He says, this day, the Lord will deliver thee into my hand and I will smite thee and I will take thine head from thee and I will give thee the crimsons of hosts to the Philistines. Now, David is speaking this before it happens. See, Goliath was already dead before the stone hit him. My God, the, the Goliath was already dead. In David's eyes, David decreed this thing. He said, on this day, I'm going to read it in the, in the, uh, in the new, the NIV. This day, the Lord will hand you over to me and I will strike you down and cut off your head. Today, I will give the, uh, cor cornices of the Philistine army to the birds and of the air. Listen, D D Goliath was already dead. Goli I'm going to say it again. The season in which you have prayed for is upon you now. D Goliath was already dead before David could hit him. My God from heaven. The Bible says in Job chapter 22 and 28, watch this. What you decide on will be done. I want you to hear me tonight. I, I, I want you to hear me. I don't have long. What you decide on will be done and light will shine on your ways. You will be prosperous in everything that you do. You, the, the light, the success will be upon you. It says you decide. My God, God has given us the authority and the power for us to decide this thing. It says you decide what you decide will be done. My Lord Jesus, Goliath was dead before he got hit with the rock. Lord have mercy. David was, uh, Goliath was already dead before David hit him with the rock. Because David had already decreed and declared in the atmosphere of what was going to happen. The season in which you have prayed for is upon you now. Listen, it's some things that you prayed for in 2007. I come to prophesy tonight that it's already, I'm telling you, I come to prophesy in 
and to let somebody know right now the season in which you have prayed for in 2007 is upon you now. You said in 2013 that you was going to start your business. All you got to do now is go look for the building. Because the business is already here. The business is already prosperous. The business is already a success. I'm talking to somebody right now. You need to pick up that phone and call the ministry line at 601-885-3611 or log on to the website at empressbolton.com. Listen, there are some things in the season of 1999 that you have de decreed and that you have prayed on and that you have believed God for and you kept believing God and you were steadfast as an unmovable my God you wasn't shaken by what was going on around you when God spoke the word you believed it you added your faith to it you heard the word and then you received it with faith I'm telling you tonight I'm telling you right now if, if, if I'm sure as I'm sitting right here on this Facebook live I'm telling you right now the season in which you have prayed for is up on you now my God, look no further. You don't have to wonder if somebody going to buy. I don't care if you're selling peanuts. You don't have to wonder if they're going to buy your peanuts. You ain't got to wonder if your peanuts going to taste good. Listen, the season in which you have prayed for is up on you right now. I'm not stuck. I'm not stuck. I'm just waiting until somebody say, I receive it. I'm just waiting until somebody say, I receive it. I just need to see somebody say, I receive it. If you're listening by Facebook Live, I need you to just, just I receive it. I receive it. If you're listening by radio, I just need you to tell somebody, I receive it. Listen, I don't care what it is. If you decree it, it said what you decide on will be done. My God, I receive it. I receive it for my own self. I receive it for my own self. Listen, I speak to every delay. I speak to every deny. I reverse it in Jesus' name. I decree and declare that it will be successful. I decree and declare that the doors will be open. My God, this is the season that we speak it and it happens. Oh, Jesus. This is the season that we speak it and it will just happen. My God, we're going to decide tonight. I'm talking to somebody that needs to decide. You need to pick up the phone right now. Call the ministry line 601-885-3611. You need to meet me at One Way International Ministries 200 North 40th Avenue right here in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. I'm telling you the word of the Lord is sure. The word of the Lord has been going forth. People's lives have been changing. My God, testimonies like you would not believe. I'm telling you, it's going to be awesome and amazing tonight. But I speak no more dry places, no more dry spots. I'm, yes, debt's been demolished and bills been paid off. We have a declaration that we say before we sow our tithe, before we sow our offering. I'm telling you, people's uh, debts have been being demolished and, and all kind of miracles have been happening in people's finances and in their homes and in their families. Listen, people have been getting delivered. My God, on Sunday, we had so many testimonies. It was just powerful. It was just amazing. God is doing it. He's doing it. This is the season in which you have prayed for. The season in which you have prayed for is upon you. I'm telling you, the season in which we have been waiting for. Listen, we were steadfast. We was unmovable. We didn't care what it looked like when God spoke the word. We received it. We believed it. I know it didn't look like it. It didn't feel like it. Somebody doubted us. Somebody talked about us. Listen, everything popped off. It didn't look like nothing what God said, but we held, it on. We held on to the word. We held on anyway. And I want you to know tonight, because you held on, when you decide Decide. What you decide will be done. The word that God gave you didn't disappear. Mm -mm. The word that God gave you did not disappear. My God. But it goes into the atmosphere. It will perform what he said. It's going to do everything that he said. My God. Yes, I shall decree. I shall decree a thing and it is established. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord Jesus. I decree it shall be done for you. My God, it is no more waiting. My God, the enemy want to keep us in this waiting game. That's because our faith ain't up. We got to get our faith up. He can't, the enemy can't taunt you in, in the time when you're working in faith. Because what God said has no time and it has no space. When he speaks it, it's already done. My God, my God. And this is the season that you're going to see it come to pass. I'm telling you, this is the season that you're going to see it come to pass. We, do you know who we are? We are royalty. The genes, 
our spiritual genes, our spiritual 